Good job you. ridding us of that pest. If the planet's the way Gwen talks about you, I think you're a real one. Maybe we could get some money. I'm not gonna let you sleep on me. still Gonna have to say I swear. Next item on the front. If it isn't the Merc, put in work. Here's my mind. There. That should be enough intel for the kid. We saved that man's business. I get it now. Kind of like wow. an exterminator. You were the first to gather the data I requested. I have developed new materia. I plan to develop more materia in the future. I'll keep repairing more battle intel reports, which I hope you will assist me. Okay then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. All well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. The watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. We're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Think... Or are you just going through the motion? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick. Okay. Sure. Come over when you're done. One sec. I'll be done in a bit. <sighs> Finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village, hmm? I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. When we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. 
I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here of all places we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something exotic? Uh, really? Then again, if we're making an effort... Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. took care of the filters, so we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Mer. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. Nothing to report. Maintaining... My husband decided to go to... Thanks. Another day. Tifa, might if I stop by later? Are you gonna bless us with your cooking tonight? Scenario. I've chatted with that Barrett guy a few times. Looks like a well, hard ass. Well, you want to head inside? He's pretty chill. Well, you want to head inside? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Oh, I'm really sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime... <laughs> Grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. 
I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see your heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings, so if it comes down to do or die... If I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then... I'd rather that someone was a professional. Like you. Could still kill some time. up with that girl anyway the real deal huh Maybe just chill a bit. you're having second thoughts I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference but not like this I just I feel trapped if it feels wrong don't do it kick you out we agreed to disagree so you want another drink Tifa time to celebrate break out all the good stuff oh sure <laughs> we won't be needing you for this next job feel free to look for work elsewhere fine by me that's how I like it no contract no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This here's a private affair. it over but in the end we didn't want to put so much on you this is our fight jesse what's the hold up <laughs> be right there no hard feelings huh it's fine let's talk more after i'm done here okay 
Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here. Uh, I'll catch you later. <sighs> Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Hit the spot. Damn, Biggs. Slow down. <laughs> Keep it tight. Ain't no room for air come tomorrow. More reason to live it up now. Yep. Best way to clear your heads. What's up with them? Shut up and you wait. Won't You'll get find them soon enough. Man! Seems like the boss always gives us. <sighs> hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm. Pretty set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch to you. Five hundred. Two hundred. Mm, three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Got something to say? Ah. You looking at me? You see me there? Move it! Hey. I said so move! Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Wall Market. Am I right? Uh. Word of advice, Blondie. Don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. And don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. Shenra, then not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. I've seen them around here. Some creepy dude. Thanks to the awesome, you make the sector a better place. My husband is. So they blew up a reactor so they could save the planet?
sweet time. Uh, uh. <clears throat> Psych. <sighs> Are you gonna let me in so we can talk in private? I'll get right to the point then. Huh. What have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not. What do you think it is? A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight, you and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we... You all set? Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. <laughs> it's just another job. Tough break. They changed the times. The last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? 
What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions! Yeah! <laughs> I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber! Crank that rubber! Okay, you got it! Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. Thank <laughs> you. 